Hello, and welcome back to another Daily Top 10's Top 10 video. Today, we're going to be looking at the Top 10 Expensive Celebrity Mansions. The lifestyles of the rich and famous are beyond the comprehension of normal everyday people. But today's list will give you a peek into the world of celebrity. Number 10. Jerry Seinfeld He may be a guy famous for a television show about nothing, but someone needs to tell Jerry Seinfeld that $32 million is a long way from nothing. Seinfeld's Hamptons home was purchased from a little someone called Billy Joel, and it's described by the 90s sitcom star as laid back. How on earth $32 million worth of mansion could possibly be laid back is beyond us. What's the deal with extravagant mansions? Your pal Larry David jumped right into the election playing Bernie Sanders on SNL. What did right. you think of his performance as Bernie Sanders? It was great. It was great. I, don't, I didn't see much adjustment there. All old Jews are interchangeable. <laughs> <laughs> Number 9. Joe Montana Being one of the greatest American quarterbacks of all time gets you the sort of home that outshines Jerry Seinfeld by three million clams. Footballer Joe Montana comes in at number 9 on our list with his $35 million mansion. That much money gets you a place with a shooting range, a luxury pool, a horse stable, and an olive garden. Not to mention the mansion itself, spread out across 21,000 square feet of space. That's close to half a football field, sports fans. Number 8. Tom Brady and Giselle Bunchen. Another celebrity quarterback here, but Tom Brady presumably split the bill with his supermodel wife, Giselle. When both of you are earning absurd amounts of money, it must be easy to drop $40 million on a new LA home. The kicker, pardon the pun, the couple doesn't even live in it. They're based in Boston, in some slummy house which is probably only worth 20 to 30 mil. Number 7. Will and Jada Smith why just have a tennis court when you can also have one for basketball? Why just have a swimming pool when you can also have a lake? Sure, a media room is fun, but why don't we also throw in a professional recording studio? The Smith's 25,000 square feet California mansion sounds mighty fine. It would have to be. It was listed at $42 million. Jada told People Magazine that the home was a spiritual endeavor, but it sounds more like a monetary one to us. Number 6. Jay-Z and Beyonce Just sneaking ahead of Will Jada and the kids is the king and queen of music, Jay-Z and Beyonce. Their $43.5 million abode is not theirs to own, they rent. We guess it's actually not a bad idea to rent if you're filthy rich and traveling constantly is part of your lifestyle. Nicknamed the Sandcastle, the property comes with a bowling alley, a private movie theater, and a halfpipe for all that skateboarding the couple probably don't do. Number 5. Ryan Seacrest Seacrest may be the current resident of this home valued at $49 million, but don't forget to tip your cap to the mansion's previous resident, Ellen DeGeneres. Ellen handed over the keys in 2012. And since then, Seacrest has been the one to enjoy the property's three spacious acres, three guest houses, and two swimming pools. Sat high atop Hollywood Hills, the property is actually four plots of land put together, which seems unnecessary, but a nifty bragging point for its owner. Number 4. Tiger Woods Here's a home that its owner had a hand in creating. But that's a necessity if you want to build a golf course in your backyard. Starting with a three and a half acre piece of land overlooking the water on Florida's Jupiter Island, Woods had his team construct a plot designed to meet the quality conditions of a championship golf course. Then there is the rest of the property, which features two pools, two private boat docks, a boathouse, a game room, a wine cellar, a cavernous garage, and of course, a golf training studio. Unfortunately for Woods, it turns out that a sinkhole has developed underneath his home, and now it's at danger of sinking into the Florida waters. It just goes to show, if you spend $60 million on a home, there's still room for something to go wrong. Number 3. Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie 
Now that they have split up, the question becomes what to do with the $60 million French chateau. Whether one of them gets to keep it or not, it's still number three on our list. The legal wrangling over who gets to keep the estate with the moat may go on for years, or perhaps they could organize a share arrangement. After all, the property does have his and hers helicopter pads. Number two, Oprah Winfrey. Ocean views, mountain views, million dollar views. It shouldn't come as a surprise that everyone's favorite talk show host, Oprah, makes this list. Grandly named The Promised Land, this 42-acre estate is just one of the many homes owned by Oprah, but none of the others are worth $90 million. We're assuming that none of the others have 10 fireplaces, 14 bathrooms, or a man-made lake stocked with fish either. But we could be wrong. Number 1. Hugh Hefner Here comes perhaps the most famous house on this list. Or should that be infamous? Yes, making the top spot on this list, we have to be talking about the Playboy Mansion. If those walls could talk, there's no doubt that they would have a heck of a lot of stories to tell. Featuring a garado, an aviary, a zoo, a wine cellar, a waterfall, and even a pet cemetery, the Playboy Mansion was recently sold for a not insubstantial $100 million. So, if it has been sold, what of Hugh Hefner? Actually, the deal is that Hefner, now 90, is permitted to remain in the mansion for the rest of his life. The new owner, Twinkies mogul Darren Metropolis, moves in afterwards. Thanks for watching another Daily Top 10's Top 10 video. And remember, it's our duty to entertain and yours to subscribe. Hi guys, please subscribe to Daily Top 10's, please! I love this channel so much and I really want to see more videos and I really like it and I want it to continue. So please, oh my god, I love you Daily Top 10's! I love you! Subscribe!